Good day fam people, how are you? I'm doing well and today we are back with another video of the new adventure campaign legendary edition. As you can see we are surrounded, we have no money, and we're fighting this thing, this, 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 this terrifying vampire. Okay, so we'll have to see if he'd survive a marginal amount of time. All we have to do is not die quickly. Should be easy enough for a man like me. Boom, I wasn't even aiming to kill him, I just need to trip him over. I've tripped myself over. Not ideal. But I can work with that. Oh, I literally can't dodge those arrows unless I want to risk other damage. Come on! I knew it. I knew I'd live. <laughs> uh, I have so many swords in my side. It hurts. Anyway, um... Ooh, we're gonna have an actual fight here. The secret meeting. Leaders around the world had the secret meeting in the King's Castle about reuniting and fighting against the Dark Kingdom together. What is this, Lord of the Rings? Meanwhile, a small army of the Dark Kingdom comes. Last one, yeah. Pretty much what I was expecting last one. Ooh, we can have whatever we want. We got 8k. Obviously, one one of them. Uh, we'll, we'll have one nunchuck. I don't care about them. Actually, we'll put them behind. It's two. Yeah. Right, let's make sure we have ten of these. How was... Wait, hold on. There's already six. Is it, where are they? Oh, they're all the way up there. Okay. So we need sixteen. Then uh, medieval. Macemen, because they're the goats. 26. One crazy pirate, because the dope. Uh, what? Oh, we can't have the wild sheriff. Quick draw? No, we can't afford that one. We can afford a normal outlaw, because you know he's got the good revolver. A dynasty, we can afford one nunchuck. Uh, what else is there? Farmer. You can have, like, Ten of your guys up behind. I mean, they're not very good, but hold on, how much? Yeah, we need to have 38. 38. And we can have one royal guard, because you know, goat. Wild West, 160. We can have one of these guys in the middle. Because for some reason we're missing a guy there, but it's fine. Fire! Whoa, boy, you were not supposed to jump in there. Why would they give that an ability to... Oh, I'm not ready for this fight. I am not ready for you. Yeah, you are like on another league. It's actually crazy. I'm like supposed to be a pro guy. You're literally just a... Jesus Christ. Fix the gun. Fix the gun. God damn it. My gun's stuck. Gun's stuck. I literally can't fix the gun. Come on. I'm gonna lose this fight because I. Oh, yeah. My hand's fixed. Okay, yeah, we can still do this then. Ooh, you ain't smooth like me. Boom. The savior. Meanwhile, the leaders were all up here watching the battle happen. Uh, were they watching or were they doing something else? Ooh -hoo. Anyway, uh, why is the wizard there? I guess he's the leader of the legacy faction. Makes sense. Gandalf would be a good leader. We can all agree on that. Oh boy, Royal Games comes. Royal Games from heard the news about the and comes to fight the. Oh, so we got the avatar of the actual creator. It's kind of basic, but cool, 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 cool. cool. Obviously, you got to have the Royal Guard backing him up. This is the creator of the game. Well, not the game, but a uh, creator of this campaign. So, obviously, you got to put some respect on his name and give him the Royal Guard. The Royal Guard's been jumped! Ooh, push him down, and boom. Now we can charge. We're losing people by the dozen. Oh, but nicely done. Now, if you'll excuse me, I'm going to rush ahead. The Royal Guard runs away from us. Oh, you thought, you thought you could get me with that. You think you can beat me? Boom. Oh, I'm dead. Oh, this is what I get for betraying my king and leaving him to die. Yep. Oh boy, I'm getting roasted. Ah, that was karma. That was fair. Fair karma. Okay, so clearly the royal guard is not the way to go here. 
It's the Elite Squires. Clearly, this is what we actually needed. Just a force of elites. Actually, we can afford one footman, and we're going to make him the this guy. We're not going to use the Royal Guard this time around. We just need a big shield. Ooh, we're losing more people this time quicker than... Oh, help me! Help me! Hopefully they burn their own guys alive. That'll be ideal. They're pushing us back off the map. That's how they kill us. So that's how they won last time. The Tempest Lich is not as threatening to me as I expected. Why am I being... I don't know why, but my character automatically went there. Anyway, Lich, you're done. Oh, you little, little bitch. You little bitch. It's not going to save you. I'm still going to kill you with this one, Hunter. Probably pronouncing that wrong, too. Did he just try... Did he just parry that with his... Doesn't matter. Oh, oh, how are you blocking these? This guy's actually crazy. This guy's actually the final boss. He actually parried like four or five of my attacks. Well, he didn't parry them, but he kind of just direct them elsewhere. <laughs> That's probably what parrying is. Oh, boy. That is not ideal. More dark forces. Yeah. You don't say. More dark warriors are coming, and it's getting harder to hold them. That's what she said. Anyway, oh, boy. Not great. We need something that can do explosive damage that doesn't jump into the battle immediately. Actually, forget anything I just said. We need just to uh, need to have a bunch of guys in front. Never mind the fact that they're going to get slaughtered. Elite squires, follow them up with uh, where are they? These guys, because they've got spears, and they're cool. You didn't realize they were cool like that, but anyway. Uh, Ooh, if we cut those off, can we afford something good, good? Bomb Archer isn't bad, but he's also going to kill his own guys, so that's not good, good. Uh, we'll have one of them, and... Uh, uh, we can have... Two nunchucks, why not? Fire! Surely the boss is carrying. I had a grudge with her in particular. <laughs> oh, there's a second one, obviously. There is. Why wouldn't there be? I got her. That's all that mattered. As long as I got those or two, I was, I was happy. Necromancers can take a beating, though. What? I just ceased to be. What just happened to me? I just got sn sunk into the ground. What? Huh? What happened? Oh, my God. I just got eviscerated. Oh my god. Jesus, what is what what huh? what the force? Okay, so clearly we need to start taking this seriously, or at least as seriously as somebody like I can take it. So I think a bunch of macemen in the front is actually somewhat viable. But now we have to back him up with a lot of firepower. In this case, those, those, and uh, what else can we back them up with that has a good lot of kick behind it? Legendary quick draw. I mean, aim, I suppose. Electricity would probably kill our own guys. Let's remove him because I want to have a crazy pirate over here. And they're also, you know, actually good. Where's the bomb throwers? Yeah, bomber. These guys are going to be the main damage dealers, I feel. Obviously, you got to respect their field of work, giving them allies that they like working with. Die, Necromancers. Die, uh, Voodoo. In the end, the Coward won the battle for the team. If he could get up, he would have. Ooh, almost could, I almost blew myself up. A our savior 
private crazy or something like that, isn't it? Well, I'm happy. We won that battle fair and square. What is the unit actually called? Uh, crazy pirate. Okay, crazy pirate is kind of a basic name, but you know, we're surrounded. Escape from the castle. King, they are more powerful than before, and we don't have enough manpower to beat them. We must escape from the castle and think of something else before they take over the whole world. We're screwed. We're all gonna die, aren't we? Okay, obviously, Macemen hold the line. Macemen hold every line. Because they're Macemen. Now, what's a powerful unit that we can use? Bomb Cannoneer, because we don't want to be spamming the same unit, we'll just use another explosive unit. Uh, don't like the Dynasty ones. We can try some of these Lightning Arrows, why not? See if they're worth anything. And we can try the Dynasty's Nunchuck. Oh, we have a timer for how... Wait for the thing to re reload, or it's, you know, it's gonna be end badly for us. Boom. Oh, I think we might just W either way. Oh, that's not good. Oh, we still won. I think we could have won that either way. Oh, the king's dead. Oh, well, that's <laughs> not very good retreat if the leader, the one you're supposed to get out, is dead. Oh, well. We were regrouped with all of our forces. Chased. The king and his party escaped from the castle, leaving everybody else to die. But they are getting chased by the dark soldiers. Meanwhile, Royal Games finally arrives. Hold on. <coughs> bless me. Uh, let's just start. Obviously, we're going to go crazy and start slaughtering. To absolutely no surprise, we have actually cleared out most of them. Unfortunately, there's the issue of us being swarmed and killed. Yeah, that guy's actually good at handling us. Oh, I hate you, poltergeist. Yeah, break your ankles. Boom. Bro, game's carried. Die. <laughs> Die. Boom, it looks like it actually looks like it smited you with the lightning at the same time. Oh boy, this... The door. What, what is it? Okay, Royal Games tells the king about a mysterious door that might contain something special. Maybe something that can help them beat the Dark Kingdom. Also, there is a rumour that it can respawn the Fallen Ones, but needs some kind of gold key to open. Wait, kind of crazy got something like the gold key from the treasure, right? The king, crazy captain, and the wizard try to open the door while the rest of them hold the dark army warriors. Wait, are they going to be like under here? Yeah, okay, so they are there. Okay, we can win this. Obviously, the AI is going to start coming this way, despite the fact we had a plan. And we're going to decimate everybody up here because Royal Games is here. Oh, this guy just jumped, but that's fine. Royal Games clearly soloed with the, with the guy, the spear guy. Oh, opening the door. Open the door. It's time to open the door. Okay, so we're literally just using this as an example. A slot holder. <laughs> Never stood a chance. And what are we getting from this? The legendary door. The legendary door opened and they came out. They are ready to assemble their armies. Fight the Dark Kingdom. Even sacrifice themselves to save the Wobby World. They are called legends. Okay, so we've got a new faction that are going to carry us. Wait, are they going to... Let me just check if there's anything else hidden behind the door. Maybe I was supposed to open the door last time. Hold on, let me actually... Okay, they're not the... Hold on, I want to check uh, first time around. Was there something in there? Let me check. Seven. Seven. No, no, there wasn't. Okay. Oh, yeah, I just wanted to make sure. Okay, so these guys are going to sacrifice themselves, and they're basically the, they're literally the good faction. They got the super boxer. 
These guys, the cool looking knights. They actually look pretty cool, the color scheme works. The Holy King, a Divine Arbiter, and obviously you gotta have the main force. So these guys are willing to sacrifice themselves. This guy's eager for a battle. He's like Thor times two. Divine Arbiter's not waiting on anything. He's going for it. Looks like we finally turned the tide of this battle. Oh, you didn't turn the tide though. You killed yourself. W. Easy fight. Easy fight. That's... We're surrounded, but that's fine. The Dark Kingdom is taking over the world. Legends and the world assemble their armies to get ready to fight the Dark Kingdom. Wait, that's actually for next video. It's chapter 8. The Assembly. So we'll see who wins the next time. On, well, hold on, we only get to see one of the... Uh, two, three. Three different types of the actual custom units. Anyway, that's all for next video. Thanks for watching, and as always, have a good day.